Commanding Heights is an incredibly ambitious uh, multimedia website and uh, television program integrated together for uh, PBS. Uh, and it was basically the history of the world's economy for the last hundred years. And it was basically a hundred years times some, I think, 35 different countries times some 35 different topics. So it was an enormous amount of information uh, that we were basically having to sculpt and serve up on the website. And uh, this was back in those days when a large consideration was would it work in both Netscape and Internet Explorer. Now, my job in putting this site together was I was basically the application designer. It was my job to figure out how we were going to make it all work and what technology we were going to use. And the reason why I'm including this uh, is because the unspoken subtext to this document is that Microsoft was a major supporter of the program a significant amount of money that they had invested in uh, in the whole production and the idea was that we were supposed to use Windows Media Player well that's all fine and good except that some of the things that we needed to do to create the experience window to window messaging in the browser basically across platform uh, across different browsers was really difficult to do in those days and it it ended up being uh, Apple's QuickTime that saved the day and so it was my job basically to get up uh, in front of everybody uh, from Microsoft and our team and explain to the guys at Microsoft that thank you very much for your million dollars, but we actually are going to have to feature QuickTime as the primary underlying uh, technology powering the site, and here's why. And uh, <laughs> so as you can imagine, that was a very uh, interesting and dynamic phone call. And once I had finished giving my presentation, the chief scientist from Microsoft on the other end of the phone out there in California. I want to say that he sounded like Will Gear, like Grandpa Walton. He didn't quite sound like him, but he had a certain homespun quality to him. Well, son, <laughs> yeah, that kind of thing. Anyway, he said, well, the fact is, folks, that we're not going to be where Apple is now in even 16 months, 18 months, maybe longer. And uh, that was that, and that was the end of the argument, and the end of the discussion.